Hello, good day everyone. Right now we're going to answer the multiple choice number 42 of the book Intermediate Accounting um, edition 2019 volume 1. I just want to give credits again to our to the authors of the book which are Ninita Robles and Patricia Empleo. So to start, let's read the problem number 42. The cashier misplaced all the bank statements for the past year. He reviewed the accounting records and discovered that the following journal entry was made to reconcile the June 30, 2019 bank records and accounting records. These are the um, following journal entry. Debit accounts receivable 152024 Debit miscellaneous expense 1250 Credit notes receivables 20000 Interest revenue 1000 and cash 130274 Pre-adjustment cash balance in the accounting records was 768370 and outstanding checks were 20750 and no other adjustments were required. The question is, what is the bank statement balance at June 30, 2019. To answer this um, question, we need to know, or oh, we need to account the pre-adjustment cash balance in accounting records. And that was 768,370. The next one, we're going to um, deduct the cash which is the credit here at the power problem. We're going to deduct 132,274. And we will going to add the outstanding checks, which amounting to 20,750. So considering all this given, the bank statement balance Oh my God. Okay. Excuse me for this one. Stand. Okay, excuse me for a while. We're going to pause this meeting. Okay, sorry for the technical problem. So again, do you know the um, bank statement balance at June 30, 2019, we're going to consider these three items, which are the pre-adjustment cash balance next is the credit cash and last one the outstanding checks so adding this tree the answer will be 656,846 which is letter c next is multiple choice number 43 the cash account shows a balance of 450,000 before reconciliation. The bank statement does not include a deposit of 23,000 made on the last day of the month. The bank statement shows a collection by the bank of 9,400 and a customer check for 3,200 was returned because it was NSF. A customer checks for 3200 was returned because it was NS, NS check, NSF, and a customer's check for 4500 was recorded on the books at 5400 and check written for 790 was recorded as 970 passes. The correct balance in the cash account was, so for this one, we're going to recognize first the account, cash account, that show, cash account balance, which is 450,000. Next will be 
um, we're going to recognize the bank statement shows a collection of nine nine thousand four hundred thousand four hundred and we will deduct the three thousand two hundred there because that was NSF. Next will be the sum of uh, next one will be should it should be four thousand five hundred, but I mean Customer check should be 5,400, but it was recorded as 4,500. Okay, no. Um, the customer check should be 4,500, but it was recorded as 5,400. So we're going to deduct 4,500 to, I mean, 5,400 minus 4,000, 4,500 equals to 900,000, but we will deduct this because it was over so we're going to um we're going to um, rotate the formula so 5400 minus 4500 4500 minus 4400 that's that is 90. And next one is a check written 4790 was recorded as 970. Just like that. 790. But it should be was recorded as 970. 790. 970. So the difference is 180,000. So this is error, error, NSF, this one, collection. So we will add this five items to get the correct cash balance, the cash account. And the answer will be 45,120. That is letter A. So that concludes our problem for today. I hope you learned something. And I'll be going to discuss the remaining um, multiple choice on our next video. So see you and goodbye.